the show that takes grilling to a whole nother level. My name is Monique again, as I said. You can call me Moniquette or Monique, whichever you're more comfortable with. Today I brought something really basic, a little bit different than what we're normally doing. I brought the good old all-American hot dog. I like to call it the unsung hero of the grill. Now what I've done in preparation was I went ahead and I simmered these hot dogs with a little bit of beer, which we have here, and some water. So I simmered those just for a little bit. So what I did was I brought you some simmered hot dogs and then a regular hot dog. So you can sort of see the difference between what a regular hot dog looks like and then once it's been simmering in that delicious juice of beer and water, it gets a little bit more plump and actually shrinks down a little bit. But we're gonna go ahead and throw those on the grill. Now I like to put them long ways on the grill so they don't roll off. We're not gonna worry too much about grill marks on our hot dogs, we just want them to taste delicious. So there we go. So once we put those on there, we want to make sure to rotate our hot dogs a little bit because everybody has seen that Franken hot dog, the one that's all bulbous and sitting in the back of the grill because it's been neglected. So what we're going to want to make sure that we do is we roll our hot dogs every couple of seconds just to make sure that we're getting a nice even cook on them. There we go. Awesome. Another thing that I went ahead and did, and I'll talk to you about as soon as we're back from our break in one minute. Thank you for joining us at Kicking Out. Great, welcome back to Cooking Out with Mona Kett today. We are um, having our hot dogs on the grill. What I wanted to talk to you about before we went to break was our hot dog buns. This is something that's really important when you are grilling out a hot dog. You need to pick a great bun. So you wanna take a bun. This is a nice big bun. It's got some nice sesame seeds on it, but this, the trick here is to throw it on the grill, get a little bit of a grill on those buns. We're actually only gonna put the bun on there just for a few seconds on each side, just to get it toasted up nicely so that it'll add a little bit more flavor to your hot dog and whatever your condiment of choice is. Now mine is just the nice spicy mustard. I don't like to go all out, all out on my hot dogs. I just want a hot dog soaked in beer, grilled, and with mustard on top. What we have here is great American hot dog, unsung hero of the grill, ready to go, ready for some mustard. I'd like to say thank you very much, and remember why stay in when you could be cooking out, and thank you for joining us on Cooking Out with Monica. Thank you.